Hi guys, so today we're going to start solving differential equations of a family of curves. So, tapos na tayo dun sa unang lecture natin about elimination of arbitrary constant. So, magmove on na tayo sa next chapter. No? So, first let us define ano ba tong tinatawag nating family of curves. A family of curves on a plane is usually defined by an equation containing one or more parameters together with the coordinates of a point on the plane. And ang gagawin natin dito sa differential equation of a family of curves, uh, the differential equation of the family is obtained by eliminating the parameters. Okay, so basically, ang gagawin lang natin is yung mga equation ng ating mga curves or lines, uh, we're just going to remove yung parameters or yung mga arbitrary constants. So we're going to show you that uh, by using some examples, no? So, magsisimula muna tayo sa mga basic example bago tayo mag-move on sa medyo mas mahihirap na sample problems, okay? And, of course, the easiest is to work on lines first, no? Yung mga straight lines natin. So, let us have this first problem. Obtain the differential equation of the given family of curve. So, ang curve natin are the straight lines through the fixed point hk. Okay? So, kailangan natin makuha uh, yung differential equation of all lines that is passing through a fixed point with x coordinate h and um, y coordinate k. Okay? So, ang una natin gagawin dito is to write yung equation ng ating line that is passing through this fixed point. And we learned this sa ating analytic geometry class. Okay? So, for all straight line passing through a fixed point, uh, we have this equation. We have y minus our y coordinate k is equal to the slope k okay, of our line times x minus the x coordinate, which is h. Okay, so this is the equation of our line passing through a fixed point. So, naintindihan na natin to sa ating analytic geometry. Okay, so in here we have to show that our line is passing through a point hk, right? So, therefore, in here, isa lang yung ating arbitrary constant, which yung slope natin na m. Okay, so first, we're going to take the derivative of the left and the right side of our equation. So, dito sa ating left side, the derivative of y is y prime minus the derivative of k, which is 0. Okay, remember, this is a fixed point, so our h and k are constant, okay? And dito naman sa right side ng ating equation, uh, we have m as a constant. So, we have m times the derivative of x minus h, which is 1. Okay? So, that means our y prime is equal to m. So, this is one thing that we have to remember when we are working with lines. Okay? That the first derivative is actually equal to the slope of our line. So, using this information we can have our differential equation, which is y minus k. Okay, so I'm just copying this one, kung nasa itaas, is equal to m. Okay, so, but our m is equal to y prime. So, this is y prime times our x minus h. Okay, so, this is actually our final answer for this problem. So, katulad nung... Sinabi natin kanina, we're going to start ito muna mga basic, no? Para pagdating natin sa mga susunod na question, hindi na tayo mahirapan, okay? So, let us have another example. So, we have to obtain the differential equation of a given family of curve. And this time, we have to get the differential equation of all straight lines. So, ano yung pinagkaiba niya sa unang example natin? Sa unang example natin, this is the equation of the line passing through a fixed point. So, meron tayong fixed point. So, lahat ng line na nagpa-pass through dito sa ating fixed point HK. Now, this time, uh, walang specific mention kung nagpa-pass ba siya sa specific uh, point. But, we are asked to get the differential equation of all straight lines. So, ang gagamitin natin dito is yung equation of a line kung saan meron tayong y-intercept, right? So, we know from our analytic geometry that the equation of a straight line is y is equal to mx plus b where b is our y-intercept 
Okay, so now we're going to get the first derivative. So we have y prime is equal to the derivative of mx, which is m, um, plus the derivative of b. And we know that our y coordinate is a constant, so this is equal to 0. So therefore, our y prime is equal to m. Okay, so as you can see, katulad nung nauna, our y prime is equal to the slope okay, of our line. That's why I told earlier na isa to sa mga dapat nating matandaan no, when we're working for differential equation of straight lines. Okay, so the next uh, thing that we have to get is yung second derivative niya. So our second derivative uh, for this one, derivative of the left side will be y2 prime. And then it's equal to the derivative of our slope which is a constant this is equal to zero so these are our answers here no this is our differential equation all right so now we're going to the third problem no so as you can see madadali lang muna yung mga sinosolve natin no saka na tayo magsosolve ng mas mahirap in our next video kapag uh, may idea na tayo uh, how to work on differential equations of a family of curves. Okay, so, so our third problem, we have to obtain the differential equation of a given uh, family of curve. Straight lines with equal x and y intercept. Okay, so dito, we are it is mentioned that our x and y intercepts are equal, equal. No, So let's say here, this is our y coordinate. Okay, so let me label that. This is y. And this is x, okay? Our x-intercept in our graph is this. And let us say this is a. And our y-intercept is here, and let us call this b, okay? Okay, so if you remember in our analytic geometry course, we have a particular equation for a straight line in intercept form, okay? So if you're going to recall... Uh, we have an equation that goes like this. We have x over the x-intercept. In this case, we have a. Then plus y over our y-intercept. In this case, we have b. And this is equal to 1. Okay, So this is our intercept form uh, of the equation of straight line. All right? But given dito sa ating uh, question or sa ating example, that we have a straight line with equal x and y intercept. So therefore, our a is actually equal to b. So on this case, dahil equal naman yung ating a sa b, I'm going to substitute the value of a here, okay? So I'm going to have here x over a plus y over a, which is equal to 1, okay? So multiplying both sides by a, we're going to have x plus y is equal to a, right? Because our a will be cancelled out here and it will be cancelled out here. Now, I'm going to take the derivative of our equation. Okay, so in here we have um, dx then plus dy and this is equal to the uh, derivative of a constant which is 0. Okay, so Dividing both sides by dx, okay, so let me divide all sides by dx. We are going to have um, 1 because this will be cancelled out. So we have 1 plus dy over dx and this is equal to 0. So this is our final answer in here, okay? So, dito lang muna tayo sa basics, no? Then, on our next video, we're going to still be talking about straight lines, but we will be solving a much difficult problem compared dito sa mga sinold natin ngayon. Because we started muna sa pinakamadali, of course, para hindi tayo mahirapan sa mga susunod nating mga problems. So, this is all for now. Thank you very much for watching and have a nice day. To watch more of our lecture videos about engineering and STEM subjects, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the notification bell para lagi kayong updated sa mga videos na ia-upload namin. We are regularly uploading tutorial videos in engineering, mathematics, chemistry, physics, at iba pang subject na magagamit ninyo sa inyong pagre-review. 
So, thank you very much sa patuloy ninyong pagsuporta sa engineers.org.